Hi, I'm Artie Sequera, winner of Next Food Network Star and now the host of Artie Party, and you're watching Pop Eater. Hey, this is Zach Dion from Pop Eater. I'm here with Artie Sequera, the winner of the Next Food Network Star. What was your reaction when you found out you won? I couldn't believe it. The Next Food Network Star is Artie. Who star strikes you more? Is it the Hollywood kind of people or the celebrity chefs? I'm definitely more starstruck by the chefs. These are people who taught me to cook, to see them in the flesh and yeah. then to cook for them and perform for them um, was kind of a lot of pressure. Do you have a food idol? I could watch Jamie Oliver all day. You just feel like you're actually right there with him. There's no pretense, there's no wall. That's something I aspire to. Do you want to tell us about your show? Yeah, so it's called Artie Party, which is the same as my YouTube show, and that's right. kind of what brought me here. I'm just going to mix this together now. This whole time I've been soaking these dried figs, these black mission figs that look like this in some whiskey. A lot of American classics like sloppy joes and roast chicken and bread pudding, but I'm wrapping those in Indian flavors. Who for a celebrity would you like to cook for? I would really love to cook for Tom Waits. I love Tom Waits. My husband does a really good impression of him, so I'd like to see <laughs> like a face-off between him and Tom Waits. Artie Party, that's the best name. Ever? <laughs> yeah, that, that's just ready-made with a bow on it. The story behind the name is that years and years ago when uh, my husband and I were just dating. I think it was Valentine's Day and he said, well, okay, if you could have your own Ben and Jerry's flavor, what was, would be in it? So I was concocting it in my head and then he said, and you should call it Artie Party. 